Hey YouTube, it's Mike Pan Gangster here, and today we're going to be talking a little bit about Lost Ark and how much of this game is pay to win and how many people are getting scammed out of their money, man. I mean, this is ridiculous. Now, I do also have it right here, as you can see, but I only played a few hours and I basically got turned off by the game because once I saw that um, the amount of money people had to put to actually be able to play like the highest levels of this game it is ridiculous um, now I've read a, f a few articles I've watched a few stuff on YouTube uh, of uh, of course you know subjects of pay to win and stuff like that um, I actually like uh, this one right here because it says right here not pay to win but a dude spends 800k <laughs> okay like I still can't even believe that someone would spend that kind of money okay so with that said Anybody that says Lost Ark isn't pay to win is either delusional or just denying the facts. Now, this guy here, um, Judo, has 19 characters at max level at the moment with the best in every slot, I guess, maxed out in guilds and whatever. Okay, anyway, basically, the guy spent around 800k. Now, I do believe the guy's rich, okay? And does that... Does, okay, so this is my point. So because someone is rich, okay, um, that means that it's okay um, for someone to spend that money because he has a lot of money. R really, let, let's let's be honest with each other, okay? Is it normal that a person could pay that kind of money in a game, okay? Like even spending one thousand dollars into a game is for me. I'm old school. It's ridiculous, okay? And I've played games that are pay to win, like FIFA, for example, which people spend thousands of dollars in it. Now, I've never done it. I've spent a few hundred dollars because I was also a victim of being stupid. Not only that this game is pay to win, it's a casino. <laughs> now, the reason why I'm making this this video is because, um, by the way, this guy's awesome, man. As Aspen Gold, I love everything he does, man. Like the way he reviews stuff. Watch him. Uh, watch everybody that you see on this page. They're all good. Um, now, the, the, the reason why I'm saying that 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 that, that it's a casino because um, you're, you're paying to basically get a chance of an upgrade. So a person keeps on paying and paying and paying until they get their upgrades and get to the max level. Okay. So the only reason why this game right now has such high success in player pool is because they told us that the game was going to be free to play. So of course, everybody in their in their everybody downloaded the game. Like I've downloaded the game. Everybody downloaded. Everybody that has a PC pretty much downloaded the game. And of course, they started playing. So the player pool skyrocketed completely, right? Eventually, the reality kicked in because all the people that got to the high uh rating, uh gear rating, started realizing, "Oh shit." <laughs> I can't get any higher unless I play 20 hours a day or if I spend money into the game. Now, before we do get more into that, let's let's say, for example, like not only that these people are putting money into the game, they're not even guaranteed while they're putting money into the game to actually get the upgrade that they need. Okay? And the reason why I'm telling you this is a complete scam from from, from beginning to the end, okay, is because these type of games are games that you play okay to basically reach the top okay so when a person asks well the game is still free to play i can still play whenever i want and enjoy it and and, and you know like don't care about the 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 the, the i end part of the game right that yes if you're a type of player that is willing to play this type of game once a blue moon and not really care about you know like playing the the the, the end game then yes it's it's free to play but for Anybody that is considered like, I guess, a little bit more than a casual player that likes these types of games, is it free to play? The answer is no. It's a complete scam. It's not free to play. Because free to play would be that there will be a way for you to get to the end game and actually be able to play the end game. When, 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 when you reach that top and you have these guys that are considered whales that are like basically um, in these guilds, which you are eventually going to have to join to do these things 
and they're carrying you to reach that high level uh, gear rank for you to be able to do that content, which for me, that's not considered uh, free to play. For me, that's just a, basically a, a, a fucking scam of like taking money from the rich people, I guess, from the whales. And of course, some smaller people like us that eventually are going to put money into the game. Now, I'm not going to put money in the game. I'm not even going to play the game because personally, when I see people do, uh, when I see companies do these type of stuff, I'm, 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 I'm completely against it. When I used to play FIFA, it was all good and fun. But when Ultimate Team, um, EA Sports just fucking did everything for people to just basically spend their wallets. And, and they're double dipping because at least, at least, for example, Lost Ark, you can actually download the game for free. And what I mean by double dipping for people that don't understand is a game like FIFA, it has a yearly cycle. So not only that they know that people, that there's people that don't spend money, what they do is, oh, well, you know what? You don't spend money, no problem. We're making the game on a yearly cycle so that every year you have to buy the new game if you want to play it, right? And of course, rinse and repeat for all the other guys that just keep on spending money uh, to basically buy their, 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 their cards in that particular game. Where at least Lost Ark, they're giving you the game itself for free. You know what I mean? But then again, it's not really free because, like I said, I believe it's a complete scam because you can't play the end game. And the whole point of the this type of game is for you to get to the end game. So for me, that's not free to play. And again, when, when I look at these articles, like, for example, I was on Reddit and, and this particular guy right here says, is Lost Ark a pay to win? 100% honest review. Okay. Now you could go through it. It's, it's, it's on Reddit. You're like, this is the, the article. And, and whatever, the guy basically is defending, um, kind of defending the game. You know, like, of course, whatever. You, you got to read the article. Um, there, there are some parts that he makes a lot of sense. What he's trying to say, for example, like, pay to win literally means you have to spend money to win. Yes, yes. But is it... Sp- if you spend money and lose, it's not pay to win. See, I don't completely agree with what he's saying here, okay? Um, some people, they honestly always assume that because you're paying money, automatically you're winning. No. Uh, it, it, it's it's the fact that these guys, by paying, okay, they're getting to the, these whales are getting to that, that, that level that they're superior than what they're doing, okay? And they're 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 basically are destroying um, everything with their damage in a guild, for example. Okay, which doesn't mean they have to be a good player for them to do it. So it's only normal if like the guy tries to do it by himself. Most likely, if it's a really hard thing and it needs coordination or whatever, probably won't be able to do it. But if you're a guild and you have these guys that are high ranking, you, you're not gonna want to have them in your in, in your team. Of course, you gotta want them out just for the damage. Yeah, just click a button. You know what I mean? And you'll probably do more damage than the whole fucking like the whole guilt. So like whatever. Go read the article if you guys want. I I, I personally uh, I mean I agree and disagree with uh, some of the stuff this guy's saying. It's it's not a bad review what he's trying to say, but I just don't. I, I don't know. For people that are defend the way I see this, people that are actually defending this game uh, by saying this game is not pay to win. I mean. I think the best way to describe it is exactly like this guy here says right here. Um, lost Ark. Is it pay to win? Don't lie to yourself. You know, like, or some people are saying you're delusional or whatever, like like, like, like this this article says right here. And, and it is. You, you have to be some sort of, like, delusional person that is defending this game. I understand the game itself is a fun game, but there's no way that can people can actually defend this company and say they're they're not scamming people for the maximize their, their profit because th- that's all it looks like to me. I don't know. And I feel like this game, give it a couple months, a year, and you're going to see. It's just going to be like all the other games. It's going to fucking die out. It died out already once uh, before before it was free. And and now it's basically it's free, so it got that big boom. And trust me, it's going to eventually die out. All these games eventually die out. Anyways. That's my personal review of, of, of what I think about this about, about, about this company. I honestly believe they're, they're full of shit. That's my honest opinion of this company. And if for people ask me, should I play Lost Ark? My answer is no. You shouldn't even waste your fucking time with this company and play this game. Don't play games that are scamming people like this. It's, no matter how good the game is itself, don't even bother, man. There's so many other games out there that are just more, much more 
respectful towards their their, their clients than, than than companies like this. That that's my personal opinion. If you want to take it, you take it. If you don't, well, there's nothing else I can say. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good day, guys.